O'Keefe. Our fourth finalist is... Cordell, USA, yes. <laughs> we were just building up to it. I'll let it slide, this time. <laughs> Thank you, only once though. Where do you see yourself in the next 10 years? Right now, at the age of 22, I'm currently halfway through my Juris Doctor degree. So in 10 years, I see myself as a successful attorney and a partner at a law firm, hopefully owning my own law firm. I would also love to be a legal analyst on a major news network, and I would like to have my own therapeutic horseback riding center. Thank you. Thank you. We welcome center stage Miss Fort Lauderdale, USA. contestant joining our top five is Heather Lee O'Keefe. <laughs> joining Heather Lee O'Keefe. What advice would you give to someone that is entering this pageant next year? I would say absolutely do it. Through pageants, I've learned so many things. I have gained lifelong skills that I will keep with me forever, such as interviewing. Every job interview that I've ever gone into, I have felt like I completely nailed it, partly thanks to pageants. I've also learned that success doesn't always mean winning and that success is a continuum. Just because you don't win doesn't mean you're not successful. Being a leader in your community and being a girl boss, that's what real success is. Thank you. Thank you so much. Up. And now we're down to three. The second runner up to the title of Miss Florida USA is Heather Lee O'Keefe. going to be announcing the name of our first runner-up. Our first runner-up has a very important duty, seeing as if our new Miss Florida USA is unable to fulfill her duties, our first runner-up would assume those responsibilities. And your first runner-up is... Kirsten Watson, meaning your new Miss Florida USA is Monique Evans! 